Hey, what's up everyone and welcome to another very exciting video. It's been a while since we last got a FIFA Street game. In fact, it's been a while since we've had an arcade-like experience in a soccer game, period. These days, FIFA games have become a pretty accurate simulation of an actual soccer game. But the world of soccer, it's just missing some arcadey goodness. Some over-the-top exaggerated action. So I'm just hoping that Street Power Football can fill that hole left in my heart by the lack of FIFA Street and Mario Strikers. So, let's see what it's got. Off the bat, this game will throw a tutorial at you. Sure, it's time consuming and it throws a lot of information at you, but it's not overwhelming. It's not that difficult to get your head around. There are a grand total of four game modes. The game modes are Become a King. This is a sort of story mode like thing of the game. Street Power mode is a 1v1, 2v2, 3v3. This is where the game shines. However, I wouldn't say it was a butt ton of fun. Scoring goals in this mode wasn't overly satisfying. If you're gonna provide an arcadey experience, the shots at goal need to be overly exaggerated. There were some cool shots, but most of them look like this. I will say this though, I really enjoyed the goal celebrations. I'm gonna rip off some of those dance moves the next time I'm dancing. Trick shot mode. I gotta say, I didn't really enjoy this. I just didn't get any satisfaction out of kicking the ball into a glass or the ball into a bucket. For me, this mode just lacks a lot of polish. For example, sometimes when you kick the ball into the bucket, there's an explosion, but there's no giant pow. I just feel like that noise would be satisfying here after creating an explosion. Same with the glass bottles. When you kick the ball into a glass bottle, it shatters, but you don't really hear the sound of it. Freestyle mode is where you juggle the ball. This plays out like a rhythm game. And for someone who does not enjoy rhythm games, this mode just fell flat with me. So I didn't really enjoy it. Panna mode, this was another mode I enjoyed. Again, I didn't have a butt ton of fun with it, but it was somewhat enjoyable. This is a 1v1 mode where the goal is to perform a nutmeg. If you execute the nutmeg, it will bring you into a quick time event and you gotta get all those button presses right. If you do this correctly, you'll score two points. Another way to score points in this mode is to kick a goal, which is worth one point. Now, as I said, I did enjoy this mode, but performing a nutmeg in real life is a lot more satisfying than performing a nutmeg in this game. It just fails to capture that magic of performing a nutmeg. Even after performing a nutmeg, the flow of the game just seems to stop. It would be more ideal if it was a bit more continuous. And if you could get the ball after performing a nutmeg to get the three point play. I mean, it's still possible, but you've got that pause at the end of the nutmeg. For me personally, this game really falls behind in sound design and sound, it's the most important thing you'll ever hear. I feel like this game just needs some commentary. I just feel like it needs some ambience as well. But if you could hear the players just calling out to each other, cheering when the team kicks a goal, it just needs that extra layer of sound design to really add a bit more polish to it. And as for the game's soundtrack, I personally didn't like it, but I may not be the target audience. Maybe soccer fans like this type of music, I don't know. Or maybe I'm just too old for this type of music. Now I did try to play this game online, however at this juncture in time I couldn't find anyone to play with. So I might make another video on that in the future. When all is said and done, I highly recommend checking this game out when it is on sale for like 10 bucks. It's definitely not worth the price paying right now. Unfortunately, I had to pay full price for this game. I don't want you guys to suffer the same fate. Wait for a sale, unless you're super keen and interested in this game. Anyways, that's it from me. See ya.